central banks have changed their tone considerably in that we're looking at a more hawkish world, but they still speak in a very dovish way and act in a dovish way. I think that currencies, traditionally you've seen flight to quality where the dollar would be the mm. beneficiary. We don't see that anymore. Um, you know, there's obviously anxiety in North Korea. There's anxiety mm. over the Middle East and what's happening in Qatar. And yet for some reason, the dollar is not the flight to quality. Instead, mm. it's the euro. I think that Europe nowadays, people have swept under the rug the issues that Europe faces and now looks to Europe as being a growth story and Europe's be the beneficiary of that. Japan continues to push a weaker yen, but I think that the real story remains what has been in the first half, a weaker dollars in U.S. interest mm. will continue on to the second half.